right, how do I look? Ready? A little sweaty. A post-it? <laughs> He's eating paper! No! <laughs> There's a better place, one floor up. Today's the day. I'm gonna get the promotion. Does that mean this is my new office? Not yet. I host a dinner once a month. We can do Saturday. It's not really a girlfriend type thing. You invite idiots to dinner and make fun of them? <laughs> okay, that is messed up. I know. So you told them you're not going? Oh, yeah. No, absolutely. Why can't you just suck it up, make fun of some idiots? Sometimes you have to do the right thing. Are you okay? Oh, yeah! I saw this little guy in the street and I was trying to save him from masterpieces. Amazing. In the words of John Lennon, you may say I'm a dreamer, but I'm not. The only one. The only what? That's the lyric. Uh, you may say I'm a dreamer, but I'm not the only one. I don't think so, Tim. Are you doing that dinner? I'm sorry, I'll tell him dinner's off. Oh my god. Let it go! I feel like I'm in The Shining. Oh my god, my back, my back, my back. Is it your back? You are tight. I got in a fight with my girlfriend. I'd appreciate it if you just left. Well, who's gonna help you with Julie? Be careful around this guy. He can tell what you're thinking. I've studied the human mind. I've learned how to read it and ultimately control it. Oh! I can't move. Oh, buried move. Just move. I can't. Yeah, you can. I can't. I release you. Oh. All right, dinner's about to start. There's been a complication. Julie! You invited him to that dinner to impress your boss. He's a sweet guy. But he's a tornado of destruction. Are you sure you want to do this? That's what friends do. Tim, I'd like to introduce my friend Louis and his wife, Diane. Your wife? So now, oh, dinner is served. Mind control. I am very, very powerful. Best dinner ever. Sometimes I think you think I'm an idiot. Just stay in the chair. Chair.